Right now, uproar in Galewood as residents prepare for migrants to move into the neighborhood. The 29th Ward Alderman is holding a meeting tonight to address the news. He says he only recently heard CBS 2 Charday Gray is live inside the Edmondson Fieldhouse. Charday? Jim and Erica, the alderman is upset and some Galewood residents are livid. This park district house field house has been used for senior programs and sport events. But alderman Chris Talia Farrow says migrants will be temporarily housed here no matter what. He says a representative from the mayor's office told him Friday, 125 migrants would be housed inside the Amundsen Field House. Alderman Talia Farrow says he spoke with the mayor's office this morning and was told a total of 275 migrants will be moving in. He's calling for a meeting at 6 p.m. to discuss the park being used for asylum seekers. A representative from the mayor's office, the park district, and the police department will be there. This has sparked outrage from residents who have lived in the neighborhood for decades. Neighbors say they've asked the city for a microwave and a stove to be put in the field house and have complained the showers need fixing. None of that happened. And now they are upset. Now it's all being done for the migrants. We got to make all kind of different preparation because we don't, we don't count. Now they're fixing it all up. The beautified for what? How come we didn't have that service? They said this is happening whether you object to it or not. And this is happening whether your community objects to it or not. Uh, we have a migrant crisis. We're all aware of that. We know that. Now the question is, when will they move in? Residents hope they get that question answered at tonight's meeting, which begins in an hour and a half. Reporting live in Galewood, Charday Gray, CBS 2 News. Charday, thank you.